you wonder what brings flavour to great meals, it's always the herbs and spices. And growing herbs is the easiest thing a person can do at home. Even if you don't have a lot of space, herbs are brilliant in pots. Now my recommendation is that you make sure that you've got the kitchen essentials as close to the back door and the kitchen as you possibly can have. And to make it a lot easier, Swan Valley Nursery, who's the country's leading herb grower, have developed the range, the kitchen essential range. It's everything that you'll ever need, including things like flat leaf parsley. And if you're looking out for these plants, you'll find them in larger pots, in leading gardens, and it's all over the place. Perfect. Herbs do super well on the ground, but even better in pots. And all you need is a pot or bowl at least 20 centimetres in diameter and some really good potting mix. And I mean really good. Look for the red ticks and check the bag for extra ingredients, ideally seaweed, fish or blood and bone, a controlled release fertiliser or something fancy like feather meal. The collection is extensive and you can choose from oregano, plant it on the edge. Chuck in some onion chives, you can always do with freshly chopped chives. Parsley, I like Italian or flat leaf, but curly might be your go. And thyme, because it's good for the mind and great with a lamb roast. And look at that, doesn't it look fantastic and it's just going to get better. Now the thing with this is don't be scared to cram lots of plants into a single pot. The competition's actually really good and they'll compete against each other, producing masses of foliage, which you need to be harvesting. And as they go on, because they're taking lots of energy out of the pot, you need to keep liquid feeding them. One more tip for you, if you duplicate this, if you have two of these, you can bring one indoors, harvest fresh from the pot, and then take it back the next week and swap it over with the other. It's a terrific way to stay in fresh herbs year round.